There she is. I don't like it at all. It's nasty. It's like 6.45, I'm not gonna cry yet. This is about to be one of my new favorite books. Listen to my body now. Welcome back to another vlog. I've really missed vlogging. I haven't vlogged since Saturday and it's Wednesday. Oh, the moon's out. Oh, hi moon. Good morning, it's Wednesday the 23rd of February. Today's a really exciting day. It's the 23rd of February and today is officially my year anniversary. Anniversary, I guess, year, birthday, no, year. It's been a year since I started my fitness journey, basically. So today is a very crazy day. I'm a little bit emotional about it, but it's only, it's like 6.45. I'm not gonna cry yet. You know, I've only been awake for about 20 minutes. But I'm vlogging today. I haven't really figured out if this is gonna be more of a fitnessy vlog or just another like day in the life type of thing. We'll see. Oh, good morning, Ned. Good morning, Ned, bless you. Come here, come here, come here. I'm gonna go make coffee in a minute. He's not allowed on my bed usually. It's a good day today, darling. I'll let you off. Say hi to the camera. No. He's camera shy. Let's go make some coffee. I have a lot less coffee now. I used to have like seven ounces of caffeinated coffee. But now I think I have like one and a half. Seven ounces of caffeinated coffee is a lot of coffee. I would be buzzing basically all day. I didn't realize until after I stopped having seven ounces, but seven ounces was affecting like how I slept, how I acted, but I do like quite a big coffee. So what I do, I do about five ounces of decaf coffee. I just realized I normally pour the actual caffeinated coffee in first. So let me just do that real quick. I don't like too much because I like it I don't know, I'm, I'm just very picky about my coffee, I've realised. I like my coffee in a very specific way. I like to have enough milk, the right amount of syrup, even though actually, I bought the Monin, is it Monin? Wait, I bought this, which is the Monin vanilla sugar-free syrup. I think this is what they use in Starbucks. I don't like it at all. It's nasty. Um, well, it's not nasty but it just doesn't taste of anything. We'll get some more flavor drops for my protein. The vanilla ones are by far the best. But for now, I'm gonna use the toffee ones and I will get through that syrup, just not yet. I use a lot of syrup. Don't judge me. Right, I need to put these back in the freezer. I'm horrendous at putting ice cubes back. I managed to spill half the tray in transportation. I also don't track anymore. I can't really remember what I've like vlogged, but yeah, I don't track my calories anymore. I want to do a whole like what I eat in the day separate on that, but I've stopped tracking. I'm really happy about it. And so I don't weigh my milk with my coffee, which realistically, even if you do track, if you've got like unsweetened milk or something, or just low calorie milk, just don't, don't track it. It's like 30 calories. All of the milks I've had, that are like almond no sugar or almond unsweetened whatever they've all been like 30 calories max which is not that big of a deal oh 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 right we're gonna go read my book my book this morning is The Mountain Is You. This is, I'm starting this today. I have been reading books like there's no tomorrow recently. I just finished Girlhood. I really enjoyed it. It was a little bit like the whole time. I didn't really know what was going on, but I did really enjoy it. I also read The Kiss Quotient. I wanna say quotient, we're just leaving it there. And then now I'm reading Ugly Love by Colleen Hoover and the mountain is you. I've seen a lot of people on Instagram rave about this book, so I'm really excited. I'm gonna have a Misfits protein bar. These are the birthday cake ones. These are my favorite, maybe? These and Speculoos and chocolate caramel and chocolate brownie and cookies and cream. I think those are my faves. I've got my coffee. I'm gonna read. Also, I am the type of person who highlights in my books. Most of them I don't. Like the seven habits of highly effective people, 101 essays to read that would change the way you think that one. And I'm sure this one I'm gonna highlight because I read the books over and over again. So yeah, I'm gonna read and eat my protein bar. Fit check. 
I read chapter one of The Mountain Is You. I can't remember if I said it was called The Mountain Is Within You or Is You. It's The Mountain Is You. I already freaking love it. Like this is about to be one of my new favorite books. So I'm very happy about that, but I've washed my face and brushed my teeth. Fit chair, just realized you can see all that. Wait, we've got, this is not staying on, but it is cold, but just imagine some sort of hoodie. I don't know, I'll put a hoodie on later, but I've got Gymshark X Whitney Simmons 2.3.0, the black little crossover training bra, and the green high rise leggings. Eucalyptus, I think they're cool. So this is a fit check. I'm hitting quads today. I'm gonna to take my GoPro so I will film my workout probably, but I'm gonna do yoga. For the last couple weeks, I've been stretching in the mornings, but for the last couple of days, I've been doing yoga in the morning. I really wanna be a flexible, flexible gal. Morgan Rose Maroney. I wanna say that's how she pronounces her last name. She's a Gymshark athlete and she's super flexible. She's like a gymnast and stuff and she's really freaking cool. So I'm doing yoga. I also really wanna get a handstand. Last night I got my feet on the wall. So I'm getting there. But I'm gonna do some yoga. I'm just gonna do yoga with Adrian. I think it's the morning flow, morning yoga flow, something. I don't know, I'll put it on screen, but I'm gonna do that. It's 20 past eight. I actually read for a lot longer than I thought I would. Like I started reading at like 10 past seven and that's 20 past eight. But I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna turn on my Mac and whatnot. If you watch my morning routine, you'll know I don't go on any electronics until like eight. So yeah, we're gonna do yoga though. <laughs> gonna make breakfast obviously I'm having chalky pro oats but I thought I'd film it because obviously now I'm not tracking I do do it a little bit differently not really but still I'm gonna film it so we're gonna make breakfast and I'm gonna FaceTime my sister while I make my breakfast <laughs> halfway through making breakfast but here it is oh it's really dark here it is i've got oats with cherries and seeds i use the my vegan vanilla soy protein isolate vegan protein powder i'm gonna read again i'm gonna carry on reading this i really like to read while i eat my meals now because it makes me eat slower and actually like enjoy my food more rather than just like shoveling it down so i'm gonna read ned and sausage are currently playing Kind of, they're both just sniffing each other. So they're gonna do that. I'm gonna read my book and eat my breakfast. I'm ready for the gym. I've just put a t-shirt on and my little goose and gander sweatshirt just to go to the gym in. I've just spent the last like, hour editing what you're watching because I'm really behind on my filming. So this is going up on Friday and it's currently Wednesday. So yeah, but we're gonna go to the gym and I'm hitting quads. So I am taking my GoPro. I'll see what I film. I forgot to take my supplements. I'm gonna take them quickly. My supplement intake has increased i now take biotin magnesium with zinc Hi. which is my mum's and vitamin d i've never which is also my mum's but my mum wants me to be healthy i'm not very good at taking pills i also seem to always start with the easiest these are massive How do I take the vitamin D thing? Just spray it. Yeah, 
Okay. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna go to the gym. wasn't the best wasn't the worst i've made lunch i've got a sweet and savory bagel basically one side has avocado and egg the other side has cashew butter and banana there she is i'm gonna eat this watch some youtube drink a lot of water because i can tell that my water intake is low right now it's half past two how the frick is it half past two i honestly thought it was about five past two right okay yeah i'm gonna eat this and then get into some editing i'm also watching <laughs> I'm watching the Meshka, Mesh, Messica, Meshka twins on YouTube. And stuff, so I'm not going through so much food, but for the sake of this video, smoothie for some reason i'm just so freaking hungry at lunchtime it's probably because i do go to gym but one of my favorite things since not tracking is i just like listen to my body now and it is actually quite hard tracking it's amazing and i don't want to fault it i literally did it for a year like i do not fault tracking at all but it removes a lot of control from you like you're in control but it removes a lot of control from your body because the app basically tells you when to eat, what to eat, how much to eat, blah, blah, blah. And I noticed on days where I wasn't tracking, I literally didn't know what to do if I was hungry. Like I couldn't differentiate the hunger, the boredom, full, like I couldn't actually figure out what my body wanted. And I'm still definitely figuring it out. You know, sometimes hunger cues can be like thirst or just boredom or something else and listening to my cravings, etc. Like I'm basically refixing my relationship with my body internally. What am I trying to say? One of the things I've learned is that tracking, it just removes listening to your body. And now that I'm not tracking, that's something I'm really focusing on. Like my lunch was really nice. I really enjoyed it, but I finished it and I didn't feel remotely different. Like not even, I didn't even feel like I'd eaten. And at the moment, I don't know, the last couple of days I've been in the gym because I eat breakfast at like half nine and then I go to the gym. For some reason, the last couple of days, halfway through the gym, I just become ravenous. I'm on the bus home in like hunger pain. So I don't know what's up with my body, but I'm here for it because it means I get home and eat a fat lunch. So this smoothie is banana, oats, frozen berries, vanilla protein powder, lotus, and almond milk. I'm gonna eat this and I'm gonna go upstairs and actually use some editing. Oh, should I go and do editing now? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna edit now. I was watching YouTube, but I don't have time. We're gonna watch YouTube later. I'm also gonna fill up my water again, but we're gonna go do some editing. We're going on a walk. You just stared at me. I want mum to take an Instagram of me. That is simply the only reason why I'm coming on this walk. Thank you, Ned. You excited? I haven't got any trousers on. Oh.
I've got some ice cream for pudding. This is the Jude's chocolate ice cream. I've got a lot. I didn't even realize I did this much. I'm back in my room because I need to get this editing done. I'm literally editing what you're watching as I'm filming it. So I'm going to eat this. But I actually think I'm going to end this vlog now just because it's half seven i'm just gonna edit read my book and then i'm gonna get into bed thank you so much for watching i really hope you enjoyed follow my instagrams i have another video coming on tuesday and yeah i love you so much have an amazing rest of your day kiss and hugs bye bye